We knew that we would have to reach around the world at some point and tap into the global supply of essential oils. And we also assumed that we would need to increase that as well. The fact that we were able to do it with this co-impact sourcing model was just beautiful. Two thirds of the countries that we source our oils from are considered developing countries. And so we now have an opportunity to truly make a difference, to provide sustainable income for those people who are growing, harvesting, and distilling these beautiful oils for our benefit. What we're doing through these initiatives are first, job creation in rural areas where we can have a big impact. Two, working through long-term sourcing contracts and agreements with our partners. Three, helping the formation and organization of cooperatives, which share collective benefits among the harvesters and the growers themselves. Fourth, fair and on-time payments, and even profit-sharing programs that the distillers offer to the growers and harvesters. Fifth, through linking community-based and social impact projects funded through a Healing Hands Foundation. For them to get the water, they had to walk at least an hour and a half, sometimes two hours, okay, back and forth. Today we can say that it's a special day because water has been flowing since midday today. With the help of doTERRA, of course, and healing hands, okay, we put it, a good team together and that's how today everybody is happy. On either side, it's like a win-win-win situation. Sometimes it's schools that they're in need of, sometimes it's water systems, sometimes it's medical clinics, medical supplies, whatever it might be. If you can change the, the lives of these people that have so little, that's how you can actually impact an economy. We share the same values, the same philosophy. Duterte's vision is to source sustainable oils and to create co-impact at the source to improve growers' livelihoods. So we are perfectly aligned uh, in what we want to do. So that's why we, we signed an exclusive partnership with Duterte on the aromatherapy business. We are now working with more than 6,000 families in the cardamom sector. And the idea is to really improve the livelihoods of that families. I get the importance of getting back to my country and help the people in my country. Oftentimes they think that their lives will always remain the same. And for someone to be able to really come in and be able to care about them and care about their family and to give them a sense of pride for the work that they do, to know that it matters, it's amazing to see the lights go on and for them to truly have that pride in their heart to know that they're doing something good for the world. We are so committed to co-impact sourcing because this is a way we really see that we can make a difference in the world, in these countries that have no other means of help, have no other means of support. Not only, of course, is meeting the needs where we're able to obtain the, the high quality essential oil that we must have, but also uh, the, the, just the ability that it gives us to give back and to, and to help so many people and to provide employment for so many people. That's been just downright magical.